While we may have more still to endure, better days will return. We will be with our friends again. We will be with our families again. We will meet again. It's worth remembering that it is often the small steps, not the giant leaps, that bring about the most lasting change. When peace comes, remember it will be for us, the children of today, to make the world of tomorrow a better and happier place. It has always been easy to hate and destroy, to build and to cherish is much more difficult. The wartime generation, my generation, is resilient. You've all seen pictures of the Earth taken from space. Unlike all the other planets in the solar system, Earth shimmers green and blue in the sunlight and looks a very pleasant place to live. Often a child's helplessness and vulnerability bring out the best in us. Right around the world, people gather to compete under standard rules and, in most cases, in a spirit of friendly rivalry. Competitors know that, to succeed, they must respect their opponents, very often, they like each other too. Everyone is our neighbor, no matter what race, creed or color. The birth of a baby brings great happiness but then the business of growing up begins. People are touched by events which have their roots far across the world. When life seems hard, the courageous do not lie down and accept defeat. Instead, they are all the more determined to struggle for a better future. Over the years, those who have seemed to me to be the most happy, contented and fulfilled have always been the people who have lived the most outgoing and unselfish lives. For every poppy a life, and a reminder of the grief of loved ones left behind. Sport has a wonderful way of bringing together people and nations. Although we are capable of great acts of kindness, history teaches us that we sometimes need saving from ourselves from our recklessness or our greed. In times of doubt and anxiety the attitudes people show in their daily lives, in their homes, and in their work, are of supreme importance. Our modern world places such heavy demands on our time and attention that the need to remember our responsibilities to others is greater than ever. I know just how much I rely on my own faith to guide me through the good times and the bad. I believe that, young or old, we have as much to look forward to with confidence and hope as we have to look back on with pride. Though we each lead different lives, the experience of growing older, and the joys and emotions which it brings, are familiar to us all. With age does come experience and that can be a virtue if it is sensibly used.